It's a little after 8.30 right now. Come on in, baby. Uh, I am not thrilled about the weather this morning because, okay, so nor Norm, Russ just asked Alexa what the temperature was, what the weather's like today. It's currently negative 21 degrees outside. Yes, that's correct. Negative 21 degrees. Oh, sorry, Gage, I'm going the wrong way. So that's why I didn't like try to make JJ be outside and poop or whatever because no creature should be outside in this weather. Nobody. Negative 21 degrees. Are you kidding me right now? This is insane. Shit. I hate it. I think it's disgusting. And then and then she says, it's a high of 8 degrees today. 8 freaking degrees. That's it. It's going to be so cold. So freaking cold. That's why people get depressed in the winter up here in, uh, in the northern hemisphere. Because there's freaking no sun. And it's negative 21 degrees. <sighs> Humans are not meant for this type of weather, I swear. This is not, it's not, we're not built for this. This is why we have clothes. If we were built to be in this type of weather, we would have like fur and stuff. We would be polar bears or something like that. This is not natural. Well, it's natural, I guess, but... So, def I'm not happy about it. I'm not happy about it at all. Not one iota. Freaking negative 21 degrees. This is not, I'm not happy about it, as you can tell. I've said many times already that I hate winter. I hate the cold. I don't hate winter. I hate the cold, and winter just happens to bring it. So, sorry, winter, but you're on the, you know, docket of things I hate. <sighs> Negative 21 degrees. What kind of ins My hair looks like the 80, like the, when the 80s. Like if I do this, look at that. It's the 80s. Anyway, negative 21 degrees. What? I'm gonna make it. Oh, so again, it gets stuck. Russ was able to get the car into the driveway. He backed at it. So I was just gonna pull out. Well, like any normal person, you stop at the end of your driveway to check the street, make sure there's no cars coming. I shouldn't have done that. Because I did that, I ended up getting stuck at the bottom of the driveway again. So today, uh, while I'm out with Barbie, I am going to purchase two um, two buckets of that icer, de-icer stuff. Yeah, two, not buckets, they come in a pour thing, whatever. I'm going to buy two of those and I'll put them at the end of the driveway. <sighs> because it's too packed down to shovel. So we can't shovel it out. It's just not... Ugh, you know, but you know, it's good to know that we have some good neighbors uh, Not like State Farm, but we have some good neighbors Because um, I was stuck at the end and a guy drives by he says what's matter or what's wrong and he rolls his window down I'm like well, I'm stuck. He's like well, you got a truck right there. Well, I know but I mean what did he expect is the truck was gonna ram me out of the well, the truck was behind the car, so, I mean, I guess he could have pulled the truck, could have pulled the car back. Anyways, that's not what happened. Then, I'm like, it's okay, he's coming. I went to have Russ grab the cat litter and try and get some traction underneath my 
car tires um, didn't it didn't help right away uh, so first that um, yeah so that didn't help right away but then after Russ did that a guy uh, a toppers delivery guy comes by he's like what kind of car is that? I'm like a Toyota Corolla and he's like oh it's front wheel drive you got any kind of snow and front door and back of your tires the tires are just gonna be spinning as it's I'm like I'm aware I know this that's why I'm stuck in the first place because it's front wheel drive and I'm stuck in the snow I knew that I knew that already he's telling me that and kicking at my tires is not helping you know but whatever he did that he didn't, and then um, he went back into his car <laughs> to deliver his pizza, I guess. Anyways, I'm out, as you can see. Here I am. I have the hiccups, apparently. On my way to Barbie. <sighs> we meant to get out around 11. It's 12.17 right now. It's very warm in this car at the moment. So let's put these on my feet, because I'd like to have some more feet. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, so that was a fun time. Anyways, um, later on tonight, I'm going to Crucible with Russ. It's a club here in Madison, the Crucible. Um, I'm going to club with Russ, and Norm will be there, and there's going to be a drag show from what I gather, and I guess some other kind of performers, I don't really know. But it sounds like a lot of fun, so we're gonna do that. I'm gonna ask Barbie if maybe she wants to go, and if she does, that's awesome. Um, we'll probably take the truck, because, uh, you know, snow, and we don't need to be getting stuck again. So I've decided that until we can get the, side, the uh, driveway accessible for this vehicle, it will be parked on the street. I don't like it, but when you don't have a garage, this is kind of your only options. Just park in the driveway, get stuck in the driveway, or park in the street. Yeah, and hopefully the plow won't plow you in. That's really all we can, you know, hope for. That's all we can hope for. So anyways, I'm going to concentrate on driving and I'll be... So as you can see, I have hat hair, helmet head or helmet hair or whatever you want to call it, hat hair or helmet hair. Um, it's very easy to fix. Get your bottle of water, spray, 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 and scrunch, spray and scrunch, and then like that. That would be it, but I've got to get this part down here, too. So, I need two hands, all right? Uh, and then I See? Spray and scrunch. And that's it. Now, we went out, I went out with to brunch with Barbie. It was, it was lunch. It was afternoon. And so, and we chit-chatted. We went to Perkins. And we went uh, just driving try this again. There we go. Uh, Chit-chatting, whatever. And then started to snow some more. That's my car right there. The windshield. Apparently one of my wipers is busted now. It's not busted. The blade on it is coming off or whatever. Can you see it snowing? I have no idea if you can. It's not... It's not like huge flakes, but it's it's snowing at a pretty good rate. So, Russ is gonna head out because he's out of toothpaste. We are out of toothpaste, I should say. He's gonna take the truck. I did get the de-icer stuff. I'm not gonna put it out yet because it's cold and I don't wanna. So anyways, um, later on at the Crucible, like I said, there'll be a drag show. We're gonna go and watch the drag show and other performers do 
whatever it is they do. I need my water. Where did I put that? Did I not bring it in? I thought I brought it in. Oh, Nelly. If I didn't bring it in. Damn it. It's in the car. I have to go go outside and get it. Russ has decided that for supper, he would like uh, tacos, surprise, and nacho fries. So he has purchased french fries, two regular french fries. And we still have stuff for tacos, so I'm defrosting some meat. And uh, this bag is so this way. Oh, he got queso. I thought he got cheese cheese. He got the jar of cheese. Okay, if that's fine. All right then. Uh, yeah. So I guess I am making a uh, tacos and nacho fries. Also, guess what's supposed to happen tomorrow? We're gonna get another winter storm. Isn't that Kitty is very flat. Like really flat. Like so flat. Oh, good morning. <laughs> you were just looking really flat. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. I'm going out. I'm having issues with this shirt. I'll show you in a second. I'm having issues because it comes with this. It's the it's this. This is my shirt. Okay, I think it's a nice shirt. However, this part keeps rolling up like that. And I wonder, maybe I can like pin it down. But then the spots, like if I pin it there, it'll roll up elsewhere maybe. I don't know. This is separate. It's just like it's a leopard print. I felt like leopard print. Ugh, I'll figure it out. We are here early AF. Like, all the seats are empty right now. The people you see back there, uh, besides one of them being my husband, are vendors. There is no, there are no guests here. I think, well, maybe a couple, like, have walked in, but I don't even know. Come be in my video, husband. How are you? I'm good. Yeah, so being early AF, but we got some non-reserved seats. They're the best seats that you can get. They're right behind the reserve. But anyways, uh, so that's good. And um, that's all I got to say for now. Okay, bye. Red lighting, yes. So um, I'm gonna be signing off for tonight. It's a burlesque show. I thought it was like a drag show. It's a burlesque show, so we're gonna watch that. That'll be fun. And then I'm calling it a night. So I'll talk to you on Monday. Have a good weekend. Toodles.